Hello viewers, this is IT System Admin, a complete troubleshooting solution for you. Today in this tutorial I am going to show you how to make bootable USB flash drive for UEFI or GPT format in Windows 10, 8 or 7 computers. Sometimes it becomes very important for you so don't forget to watch full video. I'm going to show you how to create bootable using command prompt. I do not advise you to use any third party utility to create bootable USB drive that may harm your computer or that may push spyware to your computer. To make a bootable USB pen drive, you need to have a ISO image of your desired operating system. Look. Here I have the ISO image of Windows 10 computer. Now right click on Windows 10 and mount the ISO image. Click on mount. Look, the image has been mounted and you need to have a usb drive look my usb drive is g drive and my iso image dvd drive is h drive okay now click on server type cmd right click on command prompt open command prompt as administrator look the command prompt has been opened in command prompt you need to use this part tool to make proper partition of your usb drive i will create partition for gpt as because i am going to make bootable for uefi firmware okay now type this part this part and then hit enter okay i already entered in this part now i have to see all my disks uh, i may have multiple disks hard disk so i need to see the usb drive disk number so the command is list disk look i have two hard disk disk 0 and disk 2 and both are in gpt format and both have the operating system installed and i have one disk disk 2 the size is 14 gb and it's absolutely free okay now i have to select this disk 2 that is my usb drive select disk 2 now hit enter this 2 is selected clean now hit enter now convert gpt disk part successfully converted the selected disk to gpt format you have to convert the disk into gpt because i am going to make usb drive for uefi firmware computer okay fine now i need to create partition create partition primary partition has been created now 
have to select the partition and the first partition that's why I will mention the partition number one select partition one partition one is now selected partition okay now I have to format format fs means file system equal to ntfs quick format is started okay 100% completed this part successfully formatted the volume okay fine now exit from this part look my usb pen drive is the drive and my iso is mounted as dvd drive in h drive drive reader h this is the windows 10 operating system files okay now i have to enter into this drive that's why type here H clone and hit enter. Yes, I have entered into H drive. Now I need to go to this boot folder. Okay, this boot folder, and I will use this boot select file. This is an exe application. Okay, now cd boot. Yes, I, I have entered into boot folder. Now, the command is boot select. I have shown you the file. Boot acct.exe and I will use the option nt60 this option uh, is using for copying the boot code to the usb flash drive my usb flash drive uh, drive letter is g okay fine now g clone <coughs> the boot code will be copied in g drive that is my usb flash drive okay now hit enter okay Look, successfully updated NTFS file system boot code. Boot code was successfully updated on all targeted volume. Okay, fine. Very good. Now I have to uh, go back one step. That means I have to keep my position in command prompt in this drive to back one step folder tree the command is cd space double dot yes still i am in s drive that is my dvd drive where my ISO, iso files are mounted okay now i will copy all files from this drive to my usb pen drive copy command is x copy the source folder the source folder is h as because my iso is mounted in dvd drive h so i will copy all files and folders from h drive that's why the source folder is h clone backslash then star dot star star dot star for copying all files and folders that's why start dot start okay now hit space and the destination folder is g my usb drive drive letter is g that's why i have to mention here the destination drive letter g clone and then backslash now space we will 
use three option here one is use forward slash e for copying all folder and subfolder and again another option is h for all hidden folders and files and again i will use another option is f for showing which files and folders are copying to the destination folder okay now hit enter okay the x copy the spelling mistake okay i am c o p y <coughs> x copy okay fine now hit enter look the files and folders of operating system is copying to the usb drive it will take some time okay now copying is finished look all these files are copied from this dvd drive to usb drive including all hidden files and folders and also folders and subfolders now your usb bootable drive for uefi gpt is ready to boot okay this is all for today hope this tutorial is helpful for you keep watching for next tutorial thank you very much